Hello and welcome to Wonderland. We are at Disneyland Paris Resort and tonight we're going to have dinner at the downtown restaurant. It's a buffet. I've never been here so I'm looking forward to it. It's located in the Art of Marvel Hotel and let's see what it's going to be like. All right, we're going to the downtown restaurant. We're supposed to be checking in now, so let's see what happens. So from what I can see, it's very, very busy. So be prepared and you'll be fine. There's about 30 people, 35 people in front of me right now, but they're mostly families, so hopefully that will go quick. Thank you very much. Perfect. Thank you. All right. Perfect. Thank you. Hello. I am back. So, I am at the Hotel New York, the Art of Marvel, and I'm in the downtown restaurant, which is a buffet. It's chaos in here. <laughs> well, it's probably because I'm just tired, but it's just... Is it organized chaos? I'm not sure. I, I had a reservation at 6.30, and yeah, it, it's almost like a free-for-all. It's, it's really interesting. So I went down the buffet, and you'll be seeing that shortly if you haven't already seen it, and uh, just got a few things that looked kind of fun to try, just to get a feeling of everything, and uh, yeah. But it looks like at this time, that's when a lot of families are coming back from the park. Everybody's hungry, everybody's tired, and there you go. You know what I mean. So there's a big turnover, it looks like. But, you know, it, it looks nice. We'll, we'll see how it is. Here is the drink menu. And I wanted to show you this lovely placemat. Yeah, very nice. On first reaction, I'm sitting here <laughs> waiting for a waiter or waitress to take my drink order. I would love some water. There's a ton of wait staff behind me and all around, but nobody's here. It's, it's really awkward. It's just, I wouldn't even say it's organized chaos, but I, I don't know what I'm experiencing right now. I, I really don't. So I'm going to come in and show you what's going on with what we have, it looks like. Little burgers, some lovely chicken wings, a vegan pan of something, barbecue sauce, some nice green beans and corn and potatoes. Ah, little crispy potatoes right there. And some lovely pieces of vegetables in Mickey's uh, shapes. We've got mayonnaise. We've got something purple. Uh, cheese and cornichons right up there. Ketchup. Ooh, now we're talking. We've got a big thing of gorgonzola and some focaccia and a salmon bagel, a Waldorf salad. This looks like another Waldorf salad, random. Uh, we've got pesto marinated vegetables back here, some lovely cheese, a quinoa salad, we also have some fresh fruit, and we've suddenly become sweets. So we've got cheesecake, and this is a little chocolate cake. These look nice. Uh, little raspberry bombs, and peanut butter tartlets. This looks like red velvet cake some chocolate mousse, white mousse, 
and look at Thor's hammer. And we have some date muffins. Those look nice. Let's keep going on down here. We've got a little bit of bread. And we have, hello. I've got some salmon right here. Macaroni and cheese. Garlic bread. Ooh, aubergine parmesan. Different kinds of pizzas. And we have plain noodles. And we have, let's see, pesto cream sauce. We've got meatballs and tomato sauce. Different kinds of sauces right here. And over in this place, we've got some Italian ham. We've got some roast ham. More tadella. And smoked speck. And all of your lovely salad fixings. Lovely thing of mozzarella right there, and some greens, some sardines. Thank you. And just a little bit of everything. Look at that. Ooh, that looks like lovely bits of avocado. Mmm. Very nice. And then down here, we've got more fruits, it looks like. And I was told this is the Asian area. So we've got, hello. What is this? Dumplings. Oh, dumplings. Very nice. Thank you. <laughs> Lovely. All right. Lots of different Asian specialties. Ooh, roast duck looks lovely. Some nice noodles and rice. Very good. All right. And it looks like they're cooking right in front of you. So, after you, please. I am going to go back to my area right now. And I am going to go start my first plate. Yeah. So I'm sitting right here. All right. I went for purely American food. <laughs> so it's a mixture of American food and interestingly Asian food. So I've got some macaroni and cheese. Very cold. But I bet children would like it very much. Yeah. It is what it is. I found a pesto tortellini. Let's try him. Mm. He's flavored nice. He's stone cold too. <laughs> yeah. You're not going to find gourmet food here, which you know that you're not going to. But that's okay. You know, if you're hungry, a buffets are the way to go, definitely. I think, I think just with what I'm experiencing right now, I really enjoyed the Hunter's Grill. It was darker and the food selection was a bit more grown up. But yeah, it's okay. I'm, I understand the appeal of this restaurant, absolutely. But uh, you know, just come here knowing what to expect. I got a little slider. Um, he looks kind of cold too. Mm. Mm. He was warm, definitely. So, yeah. I think the thing with any kind of buffet, especially when you're appealing to the masses of so many people, you have to just have things that everybody will like and enjoy for sure. But yeah, and probably 
I'm not terribly hungry because I had lunch today, so that's on me. Uh, yeah. Absolutely chaotic in here. <laughs> on further inspection, garlic bread was very good. Chicken wings, they were passable. I ate the macaroni and cheese. My burger is really pink. There's nothing wrong with pink beef. Know that. No problem at all. It, you know, it wasn't bad. I think the shock of the first few bites were shocking. But I've had a chance to kind of relax, have some of my favorite Perrier fine bubbles. And you know what? It, it's okay. It's okay. I can understand the appeal. All right. From the magic of film editing, I prepared myself another plate. I guess that's not magic. I just told you my trick. Okay. I'm going to try their cheese pizza. This pizza they're making right over there in lovely little ovens. So let's try this. Mmm. Now that's good. That's good. It's actually very good. Very good cheeses. Well, we're in France, right? It has to be good cheese, so. Yeah, good, and the crust is thin. Yeah, good pizza. I'm, I'm happy with that. So, yeah, I, I think, yeah, it's good. Yeah, you just have to get over the mass chaos that's here, because it really is chaotic, absolutely. But, you know what, just go with the flow. That's what I'm trying to do. So, it's all good, it's all good. So, I will tell you, the roast duck was lovely. If a little greasy, but duck is supposed to be like that. But that cheese pizza was really good. And then I found a little gorgonzola, which was, lovely so i've been kind of dipping the crust of my pizza into the gorgonzola and that is pretty darn fabulous mm -hmm. absolutely so the downtown restaurant has redeemed itself i just needed to take my time with it and enjoy it and try to understand it. I'm going to try a few little desserts if I don't get another piece of pizza because the pizza was good. But I'll let you know exactly what happens. <laughs> this has to be the silliest plate of food ever. So I did get a cannoli right here. Here's Thor's hammer. A lovely little 30th anniversary macaroon. We've got a little Captain America panna cotta. And look at, I found some cheese and some gorgonzola as well. I'm gonna have a little bit of all of this. I think this is absolutely silly of me. But look at, isn't that cool? I love it. Yeah, very, very nice. Yay, attitude change. It makes it all better. <laughs> I'm going to show you Thor's hammer more close up oops look at this so he's supposed to be chocolate mix let's see <laughs> I've said this before I think I do have a sweet tooth. I just don't want to admit it to myself, but yeah, Mr. Thor has a very nice hammer. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's good. 
All right, on that note, I will see if Captain America There's his shield. And here's his panna cotta. Let's see how he is. Oh, that's delightful. Wow. Wow. Mm. Wasn't expecting that. So the panna cotta is nice and firm yet there's like raspberry coulis on top that's nice and tart. Ooh, that's good. That, that's a surprise. That's really nice. Mm -hmm. Wow, I was not expecting that. Not at all. How about a nice New York cannoli? Yep. It looks kind of ugly, but. I see what they're doing. They're great with the sweets. They're great, because usually buffets, sweets are always the worst, but these are really good. Wow. Okay. I gotcha. I understand downtown restaurant. The last one is this adorable 30th anniversary macaroon. A little strawberry macaroon. Lovely. All right. I'll take it back. I will. I like it here. I do. You know what? I'd probably give it a second try. Maybe either the first setting, when it first opens at 6 o'clock, or one of the later ones, just so it would not be so busy and crazy. But, yeah, it's really not that bad. I mean, it's, it's good. It seems like fresh food is going out all the time. And, yeah, the tables are getting cleaned as soon as people leave. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so here's what I think. I would come back, like I just said. Yeah. It's been a good experience to eat here because I've never eaten here before. You make wonderful pizza. Gorgeous pizza. Loved it. Oh, it was gorgeous. Oh, yum, 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 yum. I just finished my evening meal at the Art of Marvel Hotel at the New York Hotel at Disneyland Paris in the downtown restaurant. So on first impressions, I was a little nervous about going in there. It was chaos and craziness and just screaming and crying and people waiting around and finally got to my table, didn't know what was gonna happen saw the food it looked okay but you know what i just had to take a deep breath and try it and i was pleasantly surprised so yes i definitely would recommend coming to the downtown uh, restaurant here at uh, the art of marvel hotel i would it um it definitely has its charms the pizza was fabulous the des desserts were very good there was a big scoopable thing of gorgonzola cheese which was amazing and uh, yeah chicken wings were fine uh, they had some salads and such 
but I think you would find something that you'd probably be pleased with. Almost anybody would. So it's a good place, you know, feed the family, feed yourself. It's, it's all good. They have a full service, you know, wines and beers and everything else. I just had some nice sparkling water and yeah, it was good. It looks like the sun is thinking about setting now. So I'm going to mosey on back to the Cheyenne and that's what I'm going to be doing. So thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time back down the rabbit hole. Bye-bye.